very yeah. early in the morning here. It's about half past nine or something. <laughs> but uh, the boys here from Kenway Towers, George. So, oh, right, this on. is what was in the tyre, folks. That's the coil spring from somebody's suspension. So somebody's got no suspension on the car. But look at that. That was actually in the tyre, man. Good God. Wow. It's like a smiley face. <laughs> down, down, down smile. Right, well, thank you very much to the Kenway Tire Man there for sorting me out there. She put a sort of a puncture repair thing on it, and uh, I'm going to nip along to the garage now and see George and hopefully get that sorted. Well, I will get it sorted out. I need a, I need a new tire in there, folks. But uh, that was a. Did you see the size of that thing, man? It was like a a, uh, a coil spring simile from somebody's <laughs> suspension. Um, there he goes. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Um, right, here we go. Along to the garage. This is far too early and the coffee. That's yet. true with this. Well, it seems to be true, isn't it? That everything happens in threes. It's a strange bit of uh, old wife sort of tale, isn't it? Housemaid's tale. But uh, a Hoover, well, it's not broken, but it's, it needs it needs to replace. We had to get a new Hoover, a nice new shark one, it's called. So as it goes on the carpet, you see the fin, the dorsal fin going on the carpet. So you know it's getting right in there. They call it a shark because it gets right in there and gets all the dirt and gets all the little bottom feeders in it. Um, yeah, sorry. And um, so then there's the, the puncture in the car. The puncture. And um, has there been a third thing? Don't know, man. Not yet, there hasn't. All right, here we go, folks. <laughs> right, it's got to be done, folks. Spare! Right, folks, so if you're ever needing a spare tyre or something sorted with your car, then come down here to Kenway Tyres and speak to George. He's fantastic. He's everything sorted dead quick, man. So uh, we're very lucky that uh, I actually know G. So uh, he's just, the guy came out just dead quick this morning, man. And that's me getting the tyre fixed straight away. So it's a fantastic place, Kenway Tyres, man. It really is. I, I've always come here for my tyres. They're dead cheap, dead quick, man. And great friendly service. Fantastic. There's G just getting that tyre fixed. Where is he? Where's he going? Right, this is uh, G. What's that for, G? This is a torque bar. Oh, is it? A torque bar? All oh, right, okay. And this puts it to specified torque. Oh, so excellent. Okay, right. Can you see torque? Torque? No. Did you know you used to play bass guitar in the monkeys? <laughs> <laughs> piece of torque. <laughs> this is a fantastic piece of work here. Ding, ding. Thank you very much. <laughs> Gee, thanks so much for doing that, mate. Problem, that's right. fantastic. All right, folks, so that's it sorted. Fantastic service there from George and the crew at Kenway Tires. Absolutely marvellous. Thank you very much, Kenway Tires. Really appreciate what you did there. Super stuff. Right, I've come here to McDee's because I'm starving, man. So I'm going to treat myself to a nice big sausage making stuff and breakfast. And uh, yeah, I'm hungry. down here to the front where I'm going to look at uh, see what's going on down here at the front with the v &A and the uh, the urban beach um, just have a little look around the area because uh, I like to keep you all up to date with what's happening down here at the waterfront it's all changing here in Dundee they're spending a lot of money down here folks so uh, we'll go down and see what's happening I'm quite interested to see this whale sculpture they've, they've spent quite a lot of money uh, on this this skeleton of a whale so let's see that's uh, maybe in progress so here we go now, what is this thing what is this box here folks it's just short that's for is it who knows equipment inside it so i'm not sure what that box was there for is it for something to do with the uh, the weather the locks box they've got instruments inside it it looks like that was a solar panel on top i'm not sure Oh, that's actually bolted down here, folks. I've wrapped up, I've got my hat on, my, my snood thing, I've got my hot coffee, I've got my coat on, my cagoule. Um, it's not, it's actually really nice in the sun here. It's lovely. Uh, no doubt we'll get cold when we get to the V&A though. It's always cold down there. The, the wind howls through that tunnel there. But no, it's actually really nice down here. Probably walking back into the wind though, that'll be the, the, uh, the bad bit. It's always the same, isn't it? When you're walking somewhere or cycling, not like cycle, right? But, you know, it's uh, great. You're walking uh, with the wind and sun in your face. That's brilliant. Then we have to come back. Oh my lord! You know, wind's in your face. The sun's against you. Oh, it's cold and it's hard going. It's uphill always, isn't it? As well. <laughs> 
well on the water. Well, I spoke too soon, the sun's gone behind a cloud and uh, it's got really windy all of a sudden. So, yep, that was just within a minute of saying it was really nice. It's like... Now, folks, <coughs> the beaks of these penguins are faced inward downwards so they don't stab anybody. Um, it was a, a health and safety issue. A couple of the penguins were facing upwards and they said people could run into them and injure themselves so they've had to make sure all the beaks are facing downward. So there you go. Folks, it seems to be coming on. Uh, they've, they've got the wood down and the sands there for the urban beach. Uh, but no sign of the uh, the whale sculpture. Oh, this is quite dangerous going on here. Look, <laughs> things flapping about. Again, diggies everywhere. Crikey! I got a slap and pus here. <laughs> yeah, uh, some some sort of structure getting built there as well. Crikey! Well, that's my morning stroll done, folks. So, uh, nice quick, just a little, a little stroll. Uh, sort of did my, my normal walk in reverse, but missed out a big chunk of the Perth Road as well. So, just going to head back to the car now, go home. Next thing I'm going to do is put the Hoover together. That should take about, uh, I don't know, knowing me about an hour. Shouldn't take about 10 minutes, really. So, uh, see you in a bit, folks. Yeah.